Hey traders, how you doing? It is Friday night. It's around 20 to 10 at night. Because <laughs> this crazy market today done this other big move right back up there. I just wanted to talk a little bit about it with you guys. Um, anyway, who would ever expect it to run down like 400 points and then run right back up 400 points? You've seen this kind of move before. And so have I. And it's crazy. And it's probably because of this, you know, political whatever um, is why. The market moved. The, the, there was some sentiment to sell it off. You know, early in the in the early morning session, and then uh, in the afternoon, they decided to buy it right back up. <laughs> anyway, I want to show you something here. So, remember, I told you about my my kind of trend direction secret, which is when the five EMA is below the seven EMA. The only thing you can think about doing is selling. I know. I know that sounds crazy and stupid, but it, but it's true. For me, it's true anyway. Okay? So, as you can see, when the price came all the way down here, I finished trading right here. See how much more of a move down there was after that? But I still had plenty of profit just right here. But anyway, when <clears throat> when the market's going down and down, I know it's in your mind. Okay, we're oversold now. We're oversold. I, I need to buy this thing. And you buy it, and it goes down and you lose. And then, you, then it goes down more and you go, oh, 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 this must be oversold now. It's probably going to go back up. And you buy it, and it goes down more. And if you haven't given up by then, you're probably going to buy it again. And then it goes down more and more and more until it drains your fucking account. Okay? When if you only would have sold higher prices on the way down, you would have been okay instead of trying to buy it when it's going down. Okay? It's like trying to catch a falling fucking knife that is razor sharp on both sides. It's a double-edged knife. Okay, so next time you, you think about this, you know, you see this move down. I don't know if you're, you're probably not going to be using my moving averages, but if you are, you know, make sure you're doing only the one thing when the five is below the moving average, the seven moving average when the five is below. You got to tell yourself, I can't buy it. I can't buy it. No matter fucking what, I can't buy it. So you know how you resolve this problem? It's very simple. Instead of trying to buy it, you got to tell yourself, well, I'm not going to buy it, and I'm not going to sell it. I'm not going to sell it because even though the five is below, um, if you don't, um, how would you put it? If you... <clears throat> If you want to buy it, right, you just stop yourself. You know you can only do one thing. You know you can only do sell trades right from up here all the way down here, okay? You can only do sell trades. So if you can't find it within your mind to sell it and you, and you want to buy it, you just say to yourself, hey, this is the reason why I have the 5 and the 7 on the chart. When it's below it, I only when the five is below the seven, I can only do sell trades. When the five is above the seven, I can only do buy trades. That's what you have to tell yourself. And if you don't want to do that, you do nothing. Nothing at all. Okay? That was the point I wanted to make. So as you can see, it came back up here, did a little dip again, and then really came up here. I was trading this this afternoon. <laughs> Holy shit, man. And I was buying. I was buying in here, and it went up, and I took the profit. 
right? It went up even more. I, I bought at the high, like right here, and it went up some more. And I even bought, um, the last time I bought, yeah, it was up in here. It was before the pink line here. See, the reason why this line is pink is because usually it's this color, red. But when you mix the red with blue, you get pink. <laughs> you know how they mix paints? If you if you mix, uh, you know, uh, you mix dark blue with um, white, you get baby blue, right? Kind of like these colors of these bullish candles. So anyway, and then on the way up here, okay, you got to think to yourself, I can't sell, I can't sell, I can only buy. And what would you do? You'd buy a lower close, buy it, up it goes. See? That's how you have to say that to yourself. Oh, I'm talking too loud. I just heard them walking upstairs. It's 10 to 10. I better stop this video now. But anyway, yeah, uh, yeah, that's the point I wanted to make. My voice gets loud and it carries. Okay, that's it for the video. Good luck, good trading.